with Elma, Kimberly, and Linda. <laughs> and tonight we have a special guest, Antoine, and I'm gonna let Antoine do the other stuff in a few minutes, okay? <laughs> but anyway, we're just happy to have you with us tonight, Facebook and YouTube. And remember, this is a Christian-based talk show. We don't mind you coming on the show, long as you don't try to change me from being a Christian. That will not work, okay? All right, so we always start with my favorite scripture. Finish what you start. Philippians 1 and 6. Read it for yourself. This is my version because I'm ARP. I don't remember all of it. <laughs> <laughs> and they sure don't. Okay, so tonight we're blessed to have my baby to come back home and be a part of us. He moved away and left us here, moved to that big <laughs> Oklahoma. Well, we was talking about the casino a while ago, you know. But anyway, Antoine is back. I knew him as ambassador, but I found out he has another name. He done changed his name from me. Then he tell his mama. Okay. I'm talking about his spiritual mama and me. Okay. All right, Antoine. We are happy that you made it back to be with us tonight. Yeah, I'm right. just excited because every time he comes through the door, we give him a big, yeah. Yeah. Everybody be so excited to hear him. So, welcome back to Texas. I'm glad to be back. I'm glad to be back. I've been trying to get back. <laughs> he really been trying. Yeah, I've been trying. I've been so trying. So, what's been happening in your world? Uh, it's so much you can't see. even talk. Let me see where to start. Uh, <laughs> for one, God been good to me. I can say that. God been good to me. Um, for us, what part? The music or just my... Your life. My life? Your okay. life. You know you got to talk about okay. your music, well, too. <clears throat> for, as, for, as the, for as the life thing, uh, I've been going through a lot, uh, a little storm I was, my life, okay. for as the music. Uh, I had I had kind of, kind of, kind of jumped out there and messed with a, messed with a group. I ain't gonna say my name, but I messed with a group. Uh -huh. And um, when I got with them, it was, it was, it was more of them trying to help me but as, as as we got into the to the me performing going here going there it come to find out that they was really like charging they was charging folks money for me and i never knew about it so Are i never you serious serious i never had a chance to show up to the places like never had a chance features they you know got paid for I never knew nothing about it. So they was booking under your, what is your new name? Or can Poetic you? the Missionary. Poetic? That's why I changed it. Oh, you changed it I from changed, ambassador. I changed it from ambassador. To Poetic. Yeah. Uh, wasn't Poetic Missionary? Poetic the Missionary. Missionary. So they was booking you and getting money for and you. Getting and money the people wondering it. where is where ambassador. Right. And you never heard about it. Because every time I look on Facebook, I, I, I post like, you know, I post motivational, positive uh -huh. quotes. So I posted on there and then I started seeing like, People up under saying like, are oh, you no know, man of God? Are you a fraud? Wow. And, and I'm looking like, who are these people? So, <laughs> <laughs> you know, so I, I started inboxing them. Like, you know, do uh -huh. you know me? Like, do you actually uh -huh. know me? Who are you? Uh -huh. He was like, well, you know, I paid you for a feature and you never came. And I'm like, you never oh, sent wow. me nothing. You know, I like, well, send me the, send me the messages, you know, uh -huh. of, of who you talk to. And he sent me the messages. And that's when I was like, oh, that's wow. supposed to be my brothers. That's supposed to be my. You know, these um, supposed to be your people that's yeah, working with you, with me, and they stealing your information. Stealing so my information. Your manager. Well, he wasn't. He was. He was, he was, he was really more of like uh, they kept trying to get me to sign the paperwork to okay. to get with them, but I kept telling them like, no, nah, you know, we just gonna see about six months of a friendship type mm -hmm. thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, check but him out. How we move, mm -hmm. you know? So we started moving, but mm -hmm. I was so I was so caught up in the. The wow. happy to get you know in front of the people because right. that's what I love. I love getting in front of people, right. saving souls, yeah. talking and stuff like that. So I was too more worried on that part, just right. doing it. And I put my trust in them, you know, because we pray together. Ooh, we talk whoa. on the phone all they the time. We read Bible what scriptures you say, Kim, together. They prayed on me. They prayed on me, and that's <laughs> and, yeah, yeah, the P -R -E -Y. P -R -E -Y. Wow. Yeah. So that's where I started. You know, I started messing up. But one thing I had to do, but I had to check myself because during the time of messing with them, me and my mom. I, mm -hmm. I kept I kept calling you like she's yeah. like pray before you go because everywhere right. you don't supposed to go. Right. So that so I kind of you know I kind of blame myself for that too for mm -hmm. not just praying for the situations mm -hmm. and I just went just you know went. so I, I look at it as yeah they did that but it was really an open eye for myself okay. you know to start letting God to pray more of why I'm in this music because it's so evil yeah because you have yeah. to be covered by you your be covered. Uh, 
Yeah, so I and that, and that's what I know. That's why I be trying to get back. I know. I, I, I call every time. I call every time because I'm like, Mom, I gotta get back home, you know, because I can feel it. You know, yeah. I'm like when when I'm out there, it's like I was just it's like no like it I ain't do nothing wrong, you know, but yeah. it's just the 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 energy right. was more of sucking instead right. of motivate me like like I, I should say here you know yeah. I coming home it's I'm happy Motivation, I'm ready to yeah. do 50 songs you know yeah. like right. nothing like but up there I ain't want to do no music I ain't want to do nothing so why I ain't did wanna you do nothing. change your name from ambassador because they had already they solidified still? my name and then and then they had my name a bad name they, they they had went downtown and got it I don't know how they did it but they got the name me and my college, you about that. Is. Like, how can I do it? Because I was trying to switch right. over. over. You know, I was trying mm-hmm. to change that name and switch over because they had got the name registered, they got the website, and they had me a bad reputation. Because oh, anytime did. ambassador come up, like for as like yeah. cause I was hot. I, I was a good oh, artist. Good. So I was everywhere. And I was wondering, like, why why churches ain't Call calling me. me no more? You know, like they ain't on my stuff or none of that. So, you know, I started reaching out to different pastors and they started telling me, like, you know my name of my business wasn't right. And I'm like, no, that's not me. That's not me. I'm, my my oh, business is right. Up. You know, mine is right. But it's the people I had with me though. So, that, you know, that's the reason why the word tells you to pay close attention to your surroundings. Mm-hmm. Right. And who you, and then you don't put confidence in man at in all. In man, like, that's what I messed up. You know, with. and you have to acknowledge him in all nine ways mm-hmm. and get your covering and everything. And like go. That. Yeah. yeah. Cause that's where I messed up. I so you up. was trusting him and they was taking your music that you was writing and all this stuff. And they, so they, what, what were they doing? They were just playing it. They, they was couldn't putting perform it. it right? Nah, no, nah, they couldn't it? perform it. But what they, they was playing. doing was like they're they're so, like as because I didn't know. You see how I post on Facebook? Yeah. I post clips. I post. I post. Uh-huh. I post. I get views. I run it up. So as I'm doing that, they're steady going over there looking at theirs too. You know, cause, cause they thinking they support me, yeah. but they going to their website looking at what oh, they doing okay. and supporting. You know, they buying, wow, they had is. shirts and all type of stuff. I ain't know nothing about that. They done made shirts. They had shirts and everything on the website. <laughs> <laughs> boy, they really they had, you, boy. They had shirts and everything. I looked on there and I, I ain't even filmed the the event we had. Like uh-huh. this was the first event that we ever did together to make it like okay, let me see. He was like, well, let me see what you got, and I was like, well, let me see what you got as a manager type, <laughs> you know. So we did the event, but mm-hmm. they were filming. You know, they yeah. were filming it. I ain't getting none of the film. But the film wow. was on the website. So you didn't get any of the I ain't stuff. none no, of that. I ain't get getting any money. I ain't either. getting nothing. So not, are you suing them? Nah, I don't. Nah. He took care of probably see. another way. Uh, <laughs> 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 we ain't gonna talk about that. <laughs> hey man, <laughs> he put some hands on him. I see. It's nice to have friends in low places. You're right. <laughs> But you nah, know but, that is something how people that you yeah, think are your friends, like they're really not. And then they you come to find out that they are not your friend. They just there to get what they can get. And from what really, you. what but what really got me was uh-huh. I expected from somebody that's not not sharing the gospel, right. somebody that's not doing it in Jesus' name supposed to be. Oh, right. so if you're not. Were- these, these were Christians, Christians, right? Christians. I would say his name right now. Uh, but these but are I don't Christians. want no, I don't no. want that. But yeah. he know who he is, uh-huh. and they and they know who they are. They right here in Fort Worth, Texas. You mm-hmm. know, yeah, they right here in Fort Worth, Texas. But the thing of it is, I I I could have went at them as a you know lawsuit and this and that. But one thing I looked at is I am the. I am the talent. I am the gift. I am right, the blessing. Right. So I don't have me. to do nothing to them. Y'all right. not finna get nothing else. What y'all really did was just help, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Y'all threw dirt on something y'all thought. But mm-hmm. as this next project I got going, it's gonna tell everything. It's mm-hmm. called Motivated by Pain. Right. So That's good. Right. Yeah, it's, it's Motivated yeah. by Pain. So I'm gonna That's the part that hurt because these are Christian people that's right. that hurt you because you trusted them. And you know, and that's sad that you mm-hmm. have Christian people that do this kind of stuff that that try to kill your dream, but you're too strong for that. Too strong. You got to stay on top of. You refuse right. to come down from the wall. I refuse. You that's, know, that's my. You know that's my slogan. You know, Mama, I, uh, that, <laughs> I got that. I got that on my wall, and I'm gonna show you when I go home. Uh-huh. I got that on my wall. You said that. I refuse. Remember you said to that. That was your. That, that was your thing. Don't time. come down from that that's wall. Right. And I always be thinking that's that too. Right. Like, nah. So what did you I learn ain't. from all of this, though? First of all, I learned that I gotta, I gotta, I gotta really observe people. <laughs> <laughs> 
I can't, I can't, I can't let my, I can't let my self spiritual side take there over me go. no more. You know, I gotta, go. I gotta keep my, you know. And secondly, yeah. And learn? secondly, I learned to keep God first and and Thank let you. Him control every. Well, that's the first thing. That I should be the first. That's the first thing, thing that I learned. God. But that just yeah. popped in to say that. But mm-hmm. the first thing I learned was the. To, to, to let God, you know, rule everything before I even make a move, mm-hmm. let him control it. Right. You know, I, I was, and, and I jumped too fast on, like, I ain't ashamed to say it, I jumped too fast on being out there right. because I was like, man, I was already out there before. Yeah, so right. now this is my chance to get back out there, you know? Yeah. So I kind of moved so fast and, right. but now I know to take it slow. Right. Let God control it. <laughs> let God control it. <laughs> and watch people. <laughs> yeah. Watch go to people. God first. Go to God first. Direction. Go to God first and let, cause yeah. I, I had some funny feeling about it. And then yeah. like, just like, cause, uh, it off. uh, well, he didn't want to believe it probably. Yeah. I, they cause was, I was, yeah, I was yeah. thinking that I was they like, was man, the right thing. cause it don't feel good. You yeah. know? And then I looked on, I looked on, um, I looked on the within ministries, uh, uh, Pastor Glenn was doing it and he said, and I had woke up on it and I was, and I, and, and I looked at it and he said, he said, uh, he say people, he say, um, he say, man, you got a lot of people that, you know, that might want you to come, you know, they might say it's in the mm-hmm, spirit, mm-hmm. but you got to see which spirit that they're there calling you, you in. Right. And, mm-hmm. and, and, and I caught that. And, and, mm-hmm. and that's what kind of, I was like, oh, Lord, I see you. You're telling me don't snap back at them. Right. Don't go back at them. Right. You, that, that was a lesson for me. Right. That was a lesson for me because they didn't hurt me. They didn't do nothing. They made some money out of me. <laughs> wish I could have. I, I wish I could have got that. <laughs> but, but you know what's so what's so what's the the amazing and the best part is? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> they made money, so that means that you can make your own. I can make. Yeah, exactly. See, you see, I, that's why I said I ain't looking at it as a bad thing. Y'all just created a little lane. Yeah. Cre- created yeah, well, a lane. He's getting you ready for the big stuff. Big, yeah. See, you Amen. had to go through this here, right. so when the big thing come. You will be aware of all that. Amen. You see what I'm saying? Amen. A lot of times it's a learning experience for us. We might think it as being negative, but really it's, it's a, a positive thing for you to get ready for the next. Day. And then, you know, God allowed things to happen to open up our eyes. Right, right. To let us go through these things and say, you know what? I should have asked God first, you know? Mm-hmm. And I didn't do that. But next time I will do that. Yeah. Because you and, always and been a good on. rapper. That's that was that church. Uh, what, what was that? You used to perform at the church. Uh, go, go get them. Let me Woo, get them. I love go, that. Go, go get them, bro. We you know what? Me, uh, matter of fact, shout out to my brother, my big brother, OG Ministries, OG Carl Williams. Uh-huh. Um, that's what we're working on right now. A project is called The Road to Nineveh. Uh-huh. So, therefore, it's like, because he's been through some of the same stuff I've been through uh-huh. for us, this music, you know. So, we got a. Uh, we got a video coming out to Spears. That, that's what we're trying to put together right uh-huh. now. We're trying to make it to where like the, the video is one of those videos because we want to get that down. But that was my number one anthem and that's the song yeah. that they was trying to really get. That song is but, for, oh, you that, know, was that, that was my heart. So, you know, I went yeah. kind of crazy on them about that one. Like y'all can do anything else with anything else y'all want to do. But man, if I ever hear y'all putting Spears out of doing anything with Spears, God forgive me. <laughs> I did, but he we didn't never. Cover over. He said, God forgive. <laughs> hey, he didn't never. He didn't never let him do nothing with it though. That's the song they never could touch. But I don't that, know why the they could never called out all the call spirits, all the spirits. And everything. Yes, man. Now they ain't gonna touch that because they, they popped all them spirits that you were coming out. That you were coming out. They were scared out. to touch. Yeah, them. they were scared. To, they scared because they don't want to let some of those spirits go that you was calling out. But I love that song. Go get them, and everybody was able to participate in the church with that song. And stuff like that. But you could feel. How did you start rapping, though? Uh, I was already doing, like, the street rap. Like, okay. uh, they call it street uh-huh. rap, gangster rap. Uh-huh. I was already doing that. Uh, but I started going to, I started going to church. Mm-hmm. And as a little kid, they mm-hmm. already had told me, like, different pastors. And my mama mm-hmm. used to take me to church. Like, they had them revivals. And mm-hmm. you know how you sitting in the crowd. Yeah. You know, and they walk through. And it seemed like like most of the events that she take me to, the revival we go to, I'm always being pulled up. Oh, you're gonna be a preacher. You're gonna be a preacher. You're gonna have a voice teaching nation. So I never knew what that was. But as I started <laughs> getting older, I liked to rap. So I started rapping and rapping and rapping and rapping. And then this guy I went to church and he was like, man, you know, how about you take the curse in that of your rapping? Yeah. And I was like, I'm gonna try it. Mm-hmm. I tried it. He said, well, get saved and watch how your music goes. I was like, no, I don't rap at church. They don't understand me. I don't rap at church. I can't do that. He was like, yeah, you can. He was like, yeah, you can. You was called to be a preacher, but you was called to preach behind the beat. You don't understand that. And I was like, I like that. 
I was like, like preach behind yeah. the beat. He was kind of, yeah. you, 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 you don't post them behind the pulpit. That's you right. supposed to preach behind the beat. And That's I started good. thinking, he's like, man, everything you've been through. And when he started telling me everything I've been through, I just switch. I just, once I got, I started rapping without cursing. But once I got saved, yeah. it just brought everything, everything together. Yeah, and I just started going hard for Christ, and that's where I've been. Uh huh. So you started, how long you been doing this, though? How long you been rapping church rap? It's oh, been church rap. Now. Uh, Yeah, I've been rapping church rap for about 10. 10 years. Yeah, 10, yeah. 11 years. But so we've now. been in the church yeah. for 11 years in Yeah, June. I've been about 10, 11 years. And that's, and that's, that's I had just started. started. I, I, had thought just, that's why I, I had just started. started. I had just, just started. started. Oh, I had just started. Who brought you to the church? Uh, I forgot her name. Uh, but I was over at my friend's house recording, mm-hmm. and I had recorded my gospel song. Okay. Matter of fact, they were smoking weed, drinking everything. everything. In there. You I come in there and do my gospel. <laughs> they was like, <laughs> you know that yeah. Then you wasn't doing that go get them, was it? Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> and she came out and she was like, "Who who recording?" Oh, that, that was yeah. um, uh, 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 Quenisha. Quenisha. Was it Quenisha? I, I can't remember her name. She was a heavy set. Yeah, with head. the with the front. Yeah. yeah, that's Quenisha. And, and she said, "Come to my church." Yeah, she said, that was Quenisha. Come to my Quenisha. church. You yeah. can rap. Then I came to church. That's and you who and brought pastor. you to church. You that's right. Yeah. Like, and when God she told me you did, I said, "You got to come on up here mm-hmm. and rap." Mm-hmm. And so I mean, he came in there with well, that was go get him. Go get him. Yeah, that was yeah, that was one. I mean, Joseph Lane. Yeah, that's what he said, Joseph Lane. Yeah, that's what she was with. That's what Joseph Lane. Yeah, and stuff. I mean, it was awesome. Awesome. Mm-hmm. And now you got a little baby girl, baby girl. I got a baby boy, boy. and a baby girl. I thought that was the same. That's right. The last one was a boy or the first one? The first one was a girl. Okay. The second one was a boy. Wait, but you didn't have a boy sister. Oh, my God. <laughs> you didn't tell mama about that one, I don't think. I posted him. Oh, did you? <laughs> I must not be on your page then. I didn't see that one. So yeah, how just, is the baby girl? The baby girl is one. Oh, oh. Now, I only remember the baby oh, girl. So, how old yeah. is the baby boy? Seven months. Oh, you just had that one. So, you doing more than rapping, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you might need to rap. Nah, I ain't it rapping up. the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, come on it now. <laughs> wow. So, you got a little baby boy. What you name the baby? It's my name. And oh. someone, Donnell Thomas. He's a junior, junior. Oh, you're a junior. Okay. Junior, and the junior. little baby girl. Miracle. A miracle. miracle. Oh, she's a beauty. Yeah. I, I, I don't know nothing about my grandson, so you got to bring him in. <laughs> he was like, it was going to come today, but uh, I was so I was moving so fast and they was not ready. <laughs> and I was like, nope, <laughs> I'm not going to take all day. I'm going to go. I, yeah, I got to go. Next time we come to church, though. So, okay, you, know, you know, you know, I'm coming back home. Because okay, that's why we you got to perform for us, too. And you I got to get back. back. I got to get back. So, you get, can you perform something for us tonight? Uh, can you do something? I can do some. Uh, let me see. I got. Some, I know it's uh, hard to do it without music. No, no, no. I can do it. I can do it. Um, I'm trying to figure out which one. Let me see. We will stand up if you want to out there. Don't stand out there and do it. Right. Come on. They can, the lights. The lights. The lights. The they can hear you with the mic. We don't have people rapping. Okay, put the mic down. No, no. with the mic. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Let's let's see what you can do. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see. Uh, what you want? <laughs> no, I said I got to put the Lord first. So, Lord, what you want? Download it. <laughs> download it. Download it. Download it. Okay. Okay. I'm going to say this. Have your way with me, Lord. Right here this very day. Use me for your glory, Lord. Lord, I give myself away. Man don't understand me, Lord. That's why I choose to talk to you. And the road that you take is straight. That's why I choose to follow you. All I know is that God trying to talk to somebody today. And he sent me to tell you. Keep believing in him and have faith. Let prayer be your strength to fight when you feel like throwing your towel in. Remember what he did for Daniel when he was in that lion's den. Ask the Lord to hold your tongue. When you feel like lying again, we can fall but get back up. I self and try again. Can't nobody point the finger. Ain't nobody perfect. And God made us equal. So judging ain't worth it. If you want God to bless you, I suggest you get your praise on. I do it in the form of rap, but from the heart, I'm getting my praise on. Lord, I move myself aside. Have your way right now as I usher your presence in. Lord, feel a like life right now. Amen. Y'all be blessed. <laughs> And you wrote that, huh? Yes, ma'am. Uh, you know, I do spoken word too, though. Uh-huh. I just never, I just never tapped into it. Well, but you're going to I do, do, it, do it spoken word. We want oh, yeah, you to do it all. I'm just, next, I'm, just, I'm just motivated by pain. It's going to be spoken word. Um, um, it's going to be a lot on there. Poetry. 
This shouldn't be a lot. Wow. And I gotta get you on her, Mama. Now, now that we on her, yes, I have to say right. that I have to get you on there. All right. I have to get you on there. Okay, I, I want two on. sections. Like okay. I want you to say, I ain't gonna tell you what to say, but you know, let God tell you what to say. <laughs> but you just because it's it's two slots on there. Oh, if you bring it, we gonna keep, we gonna have yeah, you. We it's have two you slots. On the talk She's gonna be sounding like, like T.D.J. <laughs> That's right. Doing his but we are the talk show that promotes people. We right. want you to be promoted. And, and, and that's a good thing about it because you need promotion. This is the place to come. Because we do real talk. Real and we talk. want you to finish what you start. Okay? Yes. All righty. <laughs> so we, we're just happy to have you back. What would yeah. you tell uh, upcoming artists? What advice would you give them? Because <clears throat> you know we got a lot of them that want to be rappers. Whether it's in the world or in the church, what advice would you give them? For one, I would say... Um, Keep God first for one. That's what that, that's the number one thing. Uh, for two, find you find you some substance in your music. Find you some substance. Yes. Uh, number yes. three, you have to not follow the trend. You have right. to not follow the right. don't follow the trend of what everybody else talk about or what everybody else do. You have to find you because if you that's find good. you, that's, that's what's going to take. Not what you see on TV. They that's do or not what that's you right. think that's selling or not what you think that's going anything you do. You got to do it yourself. I don't know what y'all believe, but I say put Christ in it. And 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 I say that because that's that's because a lot of people get on there. A lot of rappers, yeah. like they get on there and they and they and they speak about they big homies. Uh-huh. Oh, my big homie, my big homie. But your big homie is leading you to prison. Uh-huh. Your big homie leading you to to the dirt. Your right. big homie leading you away from right. your kids. Right. Your big homie don't care about your mama. Your right. big kids don't. Your big homie don't care about none of that. Uh-huh. But I look at it as Jesus is my big homie. Right. So right. therefore, that's who I choose to represent, and that's who I choose to ride for. That's who I choose to fight for. That's who I choose to sit with. That's mm. who I choose to rap for. You know, mm. that's who I represent. So find you something. Find you somebody that's, that's right. positive to represent. Right. If you don't, if you're not, because a lot of people say, because I tell a lot of rappers, they be like, well, I don't really. I ain't really saved yet. Oh yeah, that's another thing, Mom. Go ahead. They, they said, <laughs> they said it, it's 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 gospel rappers, right? Mm-hmm. And matter of fact, I wanna I wanna say this because I was gonna go live on Facebook, but you know you can't. This, this is to the gospel hip hop world. Like we have to get out of that competition. We have to get out of that. Uh, I'm better than you, right? Uh, because Good. if we're both, if we're all representing Christ. If we're all speaking and saving souls, right. how can we diss each other? How can we mm. compete? What are you going to compete with? How many souls you save? Yeah. That's what we can <laughs> compete with. How many souls we save? Right. Like that's that's Good the point. thing. Instead of who rap better, because God don't care who rap better. He care who is effective. Yeah, yeah who go. more effective yes. with a music? And that's another thing. You guys, rappers, please. <laughs> I'm not going to drop a diss song. <laughs> but I wish that you guys would stop dropping dick songs, please. In Jesus' name, we can meet up as brothers in Christ and we can we can yeah. talk about this. We can like we've been inboxing. We we we've yeah. been inboxing about it. So mm-hmm. that's what we need to do. I've been inboxing you guys, you know. I don't know if you guys look at it as friendly or what, but we need to come together because the Why? kingdom don't need that. The kingdom do not need that. It's too much going on in the world right now. And if we don't that's stick true. together, how many can we save? That's you right. know, and 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 another thing, another thing, a lot, cause cause, cause I be in the streets, mama, and, and I be yeah, hearing what a lot of people say about show. gospel Don't rap. Hit. They be saying this, like you can't be like you gospel rappers. You can't keep coming on coming on live because you are stray somebody that smoke weed. You are stray somebody that drink. Mm-hmm. You are stray somebody that prostitute. You are stray somebody that's out there like that. If you get on the platform and say, I'm not finna hang around these type people. I don't want to be around you wow. type people. You can't say that as a platform that you have because where did Jesus walk? He didn't go to the suburbs. 
He wasn't in the suburbs that's walking. Right. That's right. He was with all the ones that you guys say you don't want to be around. So mm. that's one thing we have to do. And, and that's what I'm bringing back. For as motivated by pain is, I think it's going to come, like I'm speaking on some stuff for as the good, gospel good. hip hop world. Like I'm, I'm, I'm really speaking. They call me a gun line rapper. That's what they call me right now. <laughs> they say you the gun line. Cause <laughs> I, cause, cause you shoot it. Cause, cause <laughs> I go there. You know, some stuff they try to hide back, you know, because I be out there. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people say I put gospel on. They be like, man, you gospel rap? Like, yeah. Nah, bro, like, nah, bro, y'all think y'all too good. And mm. Then I started rapping. They be like, oh, yeah, that's gospel. Okay. <laughs> I, I, I go to church where you go. See? You know, and then I play other that's people, though. Present, yeah, bro. I play other people's songs that, you know, they, they famous or whatever. Mm. I play them and they be like, nah. Mm. Listen what he yeah. said right here, though. Why he said it like that, though? Uh -huh. Why he said it like that? <laughs> you know, so I got to be there, though. You yeah, know, like, nah, yeah. man, it ain't, yeah. you know, so that's what I really want to say. That's. If you if you looking to rap, find you some substance, find you <laughs> find you some positive to talk about, and don't follow the trend. Right, That's make up your thing. own trend. Be make, different. Make, make up your be own. Different. Yeah, be different. So you yeah. have your uh, brand that they call them. Yeah, right. a brand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. your yeah. own. Just you do that. Have a brand. So you want to be able to do that. I am so glad that you are back. So we're gonna have a fashion show for you. Okay. 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 And Kim, well, not for him it. personally. We got to change it. We gonna have fashion, fashion show. show. Not right. for you, because right. I don't want your girl coming at me. <laughs> oh, she <laughs> is. Oh, oh, no. We can't say no, no. the fashion <laughs> segment. You gonna get to see it. <laughs> We go, we go fashion for we got you a fashion <laughs> show. Yo, yo, she ain't gonna worry about that. Right. This is my show. That's <laughs> not. So if she have a problem with she can come check with me. All right, Keep so we're gonna have to do this. With it. We're right. gonna do this because we're so happy that you're on the show. So yes. Kim is going to fashion and then we're going to introduce Kirk Inspirations t shirt. Okay? okay, go for it, Kimberly. Woo! Now, I can't rap fashion. Hey, let's go, but you can't. <laughs> yeah, you can. You can rap it. Rap it, kid. Rap <laughs> your jacket. Rap <laughs> your jacket. This is my Anaheim mark. Reflective. It should be lighting up. I can't really move a lot because Emmanuel. He's shortening my runway, so I can't do a lot of twirling. I can't do a lot of twirling, so I got to do like this. I got to do like this. Go on and do it. Sebastian is this. Twirl, twirl, twirl. You can twirl the girl. This is my blueberry, my navy blueberry. Sebastian like is that. in port. I can't say where he is, but he called his mama yesterday and said, Mom, I'm in port. He's been on the water for four weeks, just wow. sitting out there wow. watching our country. Yes, yeah, yes. We love you, baby. So, Seaburn's preoccupied, my other son's preoccupied. Sebastian's not be preoccupied with someone in his life. So he said, Yeah, I got my mama. Mom, can you get me some snacks? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. First thing first. I know, right? right? Yeah. And I thought he loved me. He just wants some snacks. <laughs> okay. Okay. You gotta hold it. All right. Marilyn, go ahead. Marion, go ahead and talk about Jules. With, uh, T. Try God. Oh, yeah. She has on Kirk's yeah, Kirk I had this all on the plane in San Francisco advertising. Ooh. So who Ooh. knows? You may have some orders coming. <laughs> That's right. All right. What about the shoes? What about the shoes? Oh, my <laughs> shoes. My <laughs> shoes are by uh, Cape. Let them They're say like that. combat boots with a uh, leopard. Not yeah, leopard, zebra nice. and yeah, snake skin. Those are and nice. And, and my hat. And the hat, yeah. That matches the shoes. I'm just over the top. That's me. I'm over the top. The top. Yes. <laughs> All right. So she's going to help me with this. We're introducing Kirk Inspiration t shirt. And I think that was said, Savage. I tell you, I'm trying to learn this new terminology here. That's a beautiful. And all of these T-shirts are designed especially by Emmanuel, the owner. So if you want a T-shirt that's just for you, please check us out at www.kirkinspirations.com. And we can make your T-shirt just for you. This one is just hot off the press. And we love to inspire. And he put the little animals on there because people love animals. And we can put whatever animal you want on there. The little dogs that go woof, woof, woof. <laughs> <laughs> and the little cats that go meow. This one is God is, is that one say God is dope or which one that would say God is dope? And I really didn't know what dope meant. 
Okay, so. And this one says, for the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life. We're trying yeah, to get people it. saved. So, yeah, but. Not only does he do Christian t-shirts, he can do all types of t-shirts for family reunions, uh, class reunions. He can do special t-shirts just for you. He can put pictures on it. If you send him the design, he will be able to design it for you. Yeah. This one says God is the answer. God gave him this vision. You know, we talk so much and he came up with this and God always given him uh Visions and we put it in when you're around me. I like to put it into manifestation. And this is one we just got, you know, the movie coming out Godzilla versus King <laughs> Kong. I don't know about it, what you think about it. Just have to watch it. I, I got them mixed up. I didn't know Godzilla. I thought Godzilla and King Kong was the same ones. I didn't, I didn't know it was a different until no, I saw him come out the water. <laughs> this is another color with try God. He can also, if they have a color, you know, you want a color, he can try to get the color that you want. So please check us out at www.kirkinspace. Also, we can, uh, on the website, we will bag them up for you and we will send them in the mail. And everything, we also have the washing instructions on there so that you will be able to wash them. And that one was called Salvation. 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 That one's called Salvation. So we would love for you to check out. And we're going to have a T-shirt fashion show coming up in May. It's going to either be the first Monday or the second Monday. We're going to have a T-shirt fashion show. You don't want to miss that. Okay? And that will be live. So check us out every Monday and what? Thursday. Oh, Thursday. Oh, Thursday. They don't want to sleep on me, okay? Thursday. I tell you, 8 p.m. I tell I you, like, these two are big. Oh, my God. That's the reason why I have to wear wigs. All my hair is falling out with these two. But anyway, that's my wrap for the day. My hair is falling out because of these two. Okay. But that's why we're so happy to bless to have you on the show, I tell you. We have a lot of fun. If you would like to be on the Talk of Life talk show with Elma, please <laughs> check me out at www.elmatalkshow.com. We would love to have you to join AARP. I tell you these two here. Lord, help me. I need some salvation. At least I didn't say 545. I know. I'm not saying she didn't say 545. Y'all will be trying to watch the show at 545 instead of 8 o'clock on this one over here and stuff. So, but uh, check us out every Monday and Thursday. I'm scared to say what time. <laughs> oh, she got it. A-B-M. A-B-M, y'all. Every Monday and Thursday, we're live on <laughs> on the Monday. We are live on Monday. So if you would love to be a guest, please check us out. Kimberly is always going out there grabbing people and snatching and bringing on the show. So check us out again at www.elma E-L-M-A, not Elmer. It will not go in Elmer. Only on checks, okay? And if you all would like to donate to the Talk of Life talk show to Elmer, please, we need that. Because we want to be able to give our gifts and stuff as we grow, okay? All right. Right. Thank you, Antoine, for being on the show. And that's yeah, called Poetic Mission, right? Poetic the Missionary. missionary. Poetic the Missionary. Yes, ma'am. Okay, check him out. Is that your web page? Yes, ma'am. Okay, and we'll have that at the bottom of the screen. And Antoine will be back with us. Oh, yeah. He's coming back to Texas because he is a member of the Church Within International Ooh. Ministry. Where my husband is the pastor, Apostle Glenn, and I serve as co-pastor. Yeah. And y'all probably wonder, that co-pastor be doing everything on that. <laughs> You're right, because I'm a this sinner saved kid. by grace. grace. And I'm a kid. real person, so I deal with things that everybody don't want to talk about, okay? Because they're so holy than thou. Right. But some of them been holy. I mean, holy. So, you know. <laughs> but anyway, I've been saved by the blood of Jesus. No more holy in this house, okay? <laughs> All right. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. Thank you. Yes, man. Welcome back. All right. Oh, and he gonna have some music next time. Oh, y'all yeah, get time. I'm rocking. Y'all got to hear it, baby. Like, yeah. go get him. Woo! Go get, get him. Go get him. Go get him. Go get him. Go get him. All right. Thank you all until we see you what? Face, face to face. face. Yeah, you got it right. Face <laughs> to face. We love you. Woo! Yeah.